Hi, YouTube. How's it going? My name is Lonnie. Have you ever pulled a tongue? Just asking. Asking for a friend. I mean, he's he's really into pulling tongues. I should probably say ex-friend, otherwise it makes me look kind of weird as well. Definitely ripped that guy out of my life. What a weirdo, right? Unless you said you had pulled a tongue, in which case I accept you. This is why they call me a people pleaser. This and also just because I, I give back rubs to almost strangers that I meet. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. This game's called Pull My Tongue, and it looks kind of cut the ropey, and it has this little iguana man whose tail is in the way of the play, but where is it? It's hiding back the- Okay, whatever. We're starting at the kitchen. Greg. Greg the iguana, dude. If I ever had a freaking pet iguana, I would go for that name. Burr, pop, but what the hell is with all these onomatopoeias? What the hell is with this fresh popcorn? Dude, Keemstar, my favorite game character. I did not know it was starring he- What the hell is happening? Tip of the day is loading. It's real good. I learned a lot. Tap and hold the tongue, as you do, unless you respect people's personal space, which, I mean, what the hell's the point of that? Hell yeah, dude, I got some of your popcorn. I mean, popcorn is kind of the grossest substance on earth, and just in my opinion, you know, smells gross, tastes gross, it sounds annoying. I mean, compared to like most food. But I mean, anyways, I guess I could flex my tongue around this whatchamacallit to eat some. I mean, I'm an iguana, I got a freaking, I don't have a picky palate, you know? I'll just basically eat whatever I can get. Should I wrap all the, oh my god, how far does the rabbit hole, and by the rabbit hole, I mean my tongue go. This is weird as hell. This is what freaking Keemstar's, how he keeps his house so clean, dude. He just has a team of iguanas that just <laughs> travel freely around his house, picking up all of his old popcorn pieces when he's on the clock. I cannot stretch this far. This is improper. Why do iguana turn purple? There we go. I had to go around that that away, of course. My tongue can be longer if you do it in the proper, I don't know. I don't know tongue physics, but it's fine because I'm learning. There you go. This is a not an efficient way to eat at all. You could probably just jump down there, weirdo. But you know what? I appreciate the speed bunk or something, the moxie or something. I don't, I'm not entirely sure these are real words. I'm also not an expert on the subject though, so we're just gonna freaking keep eating this. We are tearing through these levels and now these freaking spikes are gonna wanna tear through my tongue flesh, but that's not gonna happen. Can I, no, dude, that probably hurt so bad. Oh, two times, three free light bulbs because I ran into a spike like a dumb? I mean, thanks, I guess. I could light up the world like a, like a light, really. That's pretty much it. Razor sharp, dude, you, you don't freaking, you don't tell me. Oh, didn't mean to do that, but it's fine. Just so hungry, I couldn't even wait to om nom that delicious disgust. What the? Give me. No, come that. Can I eat that? Dude, he looks so gross when he's all stretched out. What the hell? It's fine. We're just gonna get those two and just move the hell on with our lives. Our iguana lives are very busy. There's a lot of stuff going. Can I eat this guy or what? Did I eat him? I think I ate him. That's just rude. I don't even get points for that or anything. I'm just being a douche. We're gonna maybe go around the town and then this way. Where's the popcorn? I was not even paying attention to it. We could go this way and then. No. Dude, your tongue is gonna get chop the hell off in a second if I have anything to say about it. All right, there you go. For some reason, it's 20 feet long today. Now we get to go to space, is or, or as I like to call it, the kid's room. Go there now, of course. Yes, why would I procrastinate on such a thing? Let's do it, Papa. Yeah, my Papa's an iguana. You're the weird one. Leave me alone. All right, slide it down. Oh, I just slide it down with my human finger, not with my iguana tongue. That would be ridiculous. I'm all right. Thanks, Level, for the just the life update. I appreciate that. All right, now we're getting a little trickery because it's letting me decide how to put the bad boys and I don't know where the bad boys go. I'm a relatively good boy, dude. I am, I'm not an ex- Get in my- Come here, you dumb bug. Why does the dumb bug not want me, dude? My mouth is a party place. It's the place to be, if you ask me, and nobody else probably because that is just gross. Not many other living things belong in there. What we're gonna do is I'm just kind of guessing and it's working out for me, so I'm gonna continue doing it. Hell yeah. No stars. Don't need them. I don't need your twinkle twinkle. I got my mojo and at least that's what this level thinks so. Dude, I cannot talk today. I think I I may have had a few strokes already in this video, which makes sense because I love a good golf. Dude, this one's named after my favorite. We could go just straight down there. We could go not over there. This is trickery. My tongue is not freaking. My tongue is not good at puzzles. Come the hell on. Oh, I guess we could just go right there. That works. Underachieving always gets you through. Equalizer. Underachieving always gets it through. Hell yes. Watch out for the zapper. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't see a zapper around here. That's weird. That's weird that you're just making stuff up. Like there's apps. I almost missed that. Ride the lightning. Oh God. Do we have to like time this now? It's fine, I'm going for it. No, let me, give me that. Dang it, no, my Egwene. Oh, he's alive. He, apparently he's invincible. It doesn't even matter. I mean, I guess that might be a side effect of eating stars. I, that might result in some sort of superpowers or something. All right, let's do one more level. The wild one. Yes, I could not end this gameplay without doing the wild one, which looks actually very easy. No, wait, hold on, I lied. Dude, I'm feeling wild, I'm feeling, okay, it's fine. Just eat the popcorn, do a loop-de-loop -loop and pull. And your shoes are looking cool. Even if you're an iguana and you don't wear any, maybe. But yeah, this seems cool. 
definitely has like a cut the rope kind of vibe. I always felt that cut the rope needed more tongues, honestly, if we're being honest as well here, yes. What do you guys think of this game? What do you think I should play next? Let me know. Thanks for watching. Oh, hey, YouTube. How's it going? My name is Lonnie. You just caught me freaking in the middle of my vocal warm-ups. That's how I freaking warm up when I'm trying to film on a chilly day. <laughs>